Hey everyone, Aninda here and today I got a very special review or a video for you guys. It's Cyanogen Mod 11 or Android 4.4 KitKat on my Samsung Galaxy S3. Yes, it's finally here and it's very very stable. So let me just show you. This is the lock screen. So once I unlock the phone, this is the main interface. Okay, this is the main interface. If we if we swipe to the left, we get Google Now. Uh, and uh, here we have the voice search, like, okay, Google. Who is the Prime Minister of India? Okay, let's ask another question. Okay, Google. Who is the Prime Minister of United Kingdom? Okay. Okay, Google. Who is the CEO of Google? Okay, as you can see, okay, Google feature is working just fine. Okay. This is the main menu. And uh, if you press the menu button, we get options like wallpapers, widgets, and settings. Okay, and uh, from here we can change the wallpaper, whichever we feel like. Okay, and uh, here we have the list of list of widgets which we can apply. If you feel like here in settings we can activate choose whether we want Google now or not this is a notification panel this is the profile tab okay let's uh, let's go to settings In settings, we got uh, network options like Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, data. In interface, we get this dark UI theme along with themes of Cyanogen mode. Here we get some mods which we can apply. Even we can apply uh, lights, warnings, screen, animations, all these things. In sounds sounds we get all normal things battery this ROM battery is very good and uh, in display and lights we get to choose the wallpaper auto rotation screen brightness all these things even we can enable pulse notification light okay here is the profile tab you can and uh, here is the developer option performance and in about phone let me show you it's running android 4.4 kitkat Yes, the tasty Kit Kat is here, and here we get to see all the previous generation Android like donut, ice cream sandwich, jelly bean, all these things, gingerbread, froyo. Okay. 
this is running and uh, this is running on the kernel version 3.0.64 it's developed by Tamasek in this is version 1 this is built on November 14th okay now let me show you the dialer this is the dialer which we get even uh, there is even you can search for any when you can search for any place or f or uh, place or a cafe or anything or a restaurant by just typing its name over here okay like KFC if you type KFC it will search for the local KFC stores and it will get the phone number down here Let me show you the messaging app. Okay, so this is the map messaging app along with this new keyboard. And here we have the emojis. Okay, let me show you the gallery. This is the gallery. And uh, in this room, Bluetooth, Bluetooth file transfer, Wi Fi, everything works just fine. It's very, very stable. Let me show you the contacts. This is the contacts. Let me show you the music player. Okay, uh, this is the music player. so as you can see uh, here we get the full screen music album art in the lock screen as well let me show you the video by using the video player video player works fine okay, let me show you the camera Okay guys one more thing which I want to point out that uh, there is a little issue with the music player where uh, once you once you uh, start a music once you start a music and you lock the screen and when you unlock it gives a stuttering sound which can be solved by going to 
sounds and uh, we need to disable this screen lock sound and which will solve the issue ok now let me show you the benchmarks see uh, yesterday I did a benchmark on this and it got and it got a score of 18,732 let me show you some gameplay on this ROM uh, like let's play GT Racing 2 This is a brand new game. Uh, this game came out yesterday. Let's test this. guys one more thing which I wanna show you is that uh, if you go to settings here we get in developer option here we get we, need, uh, we, we can select the runtime and here we have the art the android art android runtime and if you select this the, the load time and application will be much faster actually about 5 to 10 percent faster but it's still in beta stage play store see uh, in play store play store also works fine okay downloading every app application works just fine and uh, yeah I think I have showed you every little things about this ROM if any questions or queries regarding this ROM you can ask me in comments I'll be happy to help you thank you for checking out this video if you like this video please click the like button it really helps and please subscribe more videos coming up shortly on this Android 4.4 KitKat or Sinogen Mod 11. Bye.